Evan had a very traumatic upbringing. He was both neglected and abused. He endured a lot of beatings. He definitely had witnessed many times adults having sex. He was put on heavy doses of medication from a young age, 30 milligrams of Adderall when he weighed 47 pounds. Evan came to us at age seven very much damaged. He had a lot of anger and rage. He was high strung, physical, aggressive. Evan had trouble making friends and lacked a lot of social skills. Evan has brought a lot of chaos into our home. You get angry with us and slam doors and walk off and then it's like our fault. Evan has stolen countless things from family members in the house. He has stolen money from my parents, from my wife, from my wallet. He's taken credit card numbers. I found a stash of vape one time that he had stolen from multiple places, and it was a huge amount. He broke into our safe and stole my original engagement ring. He also stole my daughter's car. Now that he's turned 18, he has now gone beyond that. Evan's been arrested three times. He attempted to steal $3,000 activating gift cards at the store. So we lived with an 18-year-old wearing an ankle bracelet in our home with two little kids. Evan has 21 plus dating apps on his phone. This is my profile picture for Tinder. I was looking for love. He is looking for attachment, acceptance. He would communicate with one girl, I love you, or I want to be with you. And then, you know, 10 minutes later, hey, do you want to hang out? Do you want to be with me? He's gotten himself into some questionable and dangerous relationships. He was dating a 33-year-old transgender woman. I believe this woman is taking advantage of Evan. I have questioned our decision about adopting Evan and bringing him into our home. There are days that we go, we're gonna be stuck with Evan forever. Well, it's good to meet you guys. This is a young man that has had a tough go of it early in his life, right? Absolutely. And you adopted him at eight? Yes, he was two weeks shy of being eight. Okay, and what did you know about his history at the time you adopted him? Um, a little bit. We knew his background. We knew about um, his biological family had had a long run in with um, CPS. We knew that they had had a lot of trouble with him behaviorally, but we did not know to the extent of how much abuse and neglect he had, he had undergone. When did you get the first sense that he just didn't have the natural attachments that you normally see? Well, I think in hindsight, the way he um, ran into Tim's arms the first night we met and said, are you gonna be my new daddy? In hindsight, that is alarming to us in a sense because now we know that he will try to attach to anyone. 